Hey, Delson. Eugene, wanted to thank you for your help. Found the conduit's hideout and about to go inside. That's a bad idea. Come on, he's a conduit who doesn't even do his own fighting. How hard can it be? No, no, really, just don't go in there. All right, I'll call you when it's over. All right, time to learn a few new tricks. Okay, so this is where they make angels. Hello? Anybody home? I see lots of vests, but no people wearing them. The hell did he do with them? Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Okay. Bigger than I'd hoped. I am oh, he God. who dwells, and you have invaded my dominion. No one's invading your dominion, okay? I just want to share your powers. Damn it. You gotta get back in there. Saw the vest down in your dominion annex. Is that where you torture the hostages you send your winged monkeys out to snatch? I offer my invited guest salvation, not suffering. You're right. None of my business. Just here for the powers. Not so easy when you don't have a minion to pick me up and fly me away, huh? Unless, of course, you can make the platforms fall! What I thought, it's lava.
I'm back in the piddly box. I'm not leaving until I get what I came for. I grow tired of your company. Angel Guardians! Your flying nursemaids can't protect you forever, pal. You're just delaying the inevitable. You gotta stop doing that! At school, I always tried to blend in, to fade into the background, to disappear. But the bullies found me anyway. They always do. 
The only place I felt I belonged was in Heaven's Hellfire. In that game, I made the rules. I could summon angels to protect the victims and demons to punish the bullies. But the real world? That... that I couldn't control. At first, I did my best to ignore them. Until that one day, when they pushed me too far. When the DUP came, they said they were taking me to a new school, designed for people like me, different. For six years, she hooked me up to her machines. She made me call them out, always, always stopping before they could save me. Then that crash. That was my chance to finally really disappear where no one could find me and hurt me but when I saw them rounding up more people who were different I knew what she was gonna do to them and I knew I knew we had to stop her It's starting to get old. So I came running. You yeah. okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Thanks, man. I couldn't have done it without you. Oh, wait. I already did. Speaking of, man, you're not going to believe what I can do now. As soon as I figure out what it is that I can do. Well, important thing is you got a kidnapper off the streets. Whoa, whoa, bro. Not kidnapper. He's more like a rescuer. Delson, listen to me. He took suspected conduits right off the street yeah. against their will. That's kidnapping. Okay, don't go anywhere. First of all, thank you for using the word conduit. Second of all, why are you being such a dick? Look, fine. Let's just agree to disagree. But we both know it's better for everyone if he goes in a cage. Hang out for a second. Can I talk to you? I thought you were all about rule of law and not locking up people without due process. Hey, normally, that's what I do. Oh, what, so it just gets thrown out the window whenever it's convenient for you? Is that it? Just put a red wig and an old trench coat on you, start calling you Augustine. <laughs> well, maybe next Halloween. Cool. So, Game Boy and I over there are gonna have a little conversation conduit to conduit no normals allowed fine if you need me be right outside okay Ellen thank you for all your help couldn't have done it without you oh wait I you already, already did, did. I know. It wasn't funny the first time. <laughs> so Eugene my brother what do you say you and me, a couple conduits, we hit the town, you teach me some of those video tricks, I teach you how to pick up girls, and we take our power to the people. Well, I'd like to find the Russians that were picking on the suspected conduits and kicking the shit out of them for a change. Dude, I want to party with you. The date then, yeah? All right. We will rise up, and we will teach them to accept us, even if it kills them. Thank you.